hello everyone and welcome back to my channel my name is debbie if this is your first time here i focus on diy style and beauty and today's video is a diy video so a little backstory on this i saw this dress on lady gaga about two years ago and i saved it because i wanted to do a diy but i usually use um fabric glue and um hemming net to make most of my DIYs so I was just trying to figure out the exact way to let it come like come out nice so I came up with a stubble well, obviously hair is long and Ghana is hot so I cannot be wearing a long dress like it's just too dramatic for my everyday wear so I decided to make my mini and the fun thing about this dress is I came up with instead of doing like the off shoulder together as a dress i decided to do um detachable sleeves so the fun part about this is you can style it with just one sleeve you can style it with both sleeves or you can even take the sleeves out and put it on an entirely different outfit just to give it like you know a little statement so with mine i i paired it with like a tank top and short so basically I can actually wear this out and that can be my statement piece because it looks cute because sometimes it's like you're trying to dress but you don't want to you know underdress as well so it can also um, serve as a statement piece you can also use it for like let's say you have a gown like color block if you have like let's say a strapless gown or even um, a spaghetti strap gown or a lot a maxi dress or whatever you can actually attach the sleeves so if let's say the dress is white you can do the black sleeves or you can even color block however you want it to be honest and i i don't want to bore you too much so i just want to jump right into this tutorial thank you so much for stopping by don't forget to comment share like and subscribe and i'll see you in my next video bye here's what you need for this diy scissors hemming net elastic band and your fabric i'm using the duchess satin like the very hard one so first thing i'm going to do is measure about 27 inches and just cut it so i'm going to cut like a rectangle out of this and we're starting with the body of the dress that's the part that's going to be the dress not the sleeves so i'm going to turn turn it so the right sides face each other and i'm just going to glue the sides just the shorter sides together so that's that's step one So after this, I'm just going to fold it in and iron it flat because that's where we're going to put our elastic band through. So I take the hemming net, place it underneath just to seal it a little. But we're still leaving a hole because that's where the elastic band has to go through. You see in a minute. So this is what it looks like. See, I can put my finger through. So that's where the elastic band is going. So I'm going ahead to do the entire, the entire thing. And then we move to the next step. So now we have the elastic band and I'm just going to attach a safety pin at the top to help me move the elastic band as it's in the, the hole. So we left, we left a little opening so that you can take the elastic band through there. So it's going to go around and then come out of that same place. So keep pulling, pulling, pulling and everything will just be coming together. So now that it's out, I'm just going to cut the elastic band, put it, put both ends together and just use like a, a needle and thread to just secure it. So 
so after that cut it off push it back in and just seal the opening so as you can see so that's the elastic band i'm tucking it in and then i'm just going to seal that opening and that's pretty much it so that is for the dress your the body of your dress is ready so we're going to do something similar for the sleeves so i will show you that in a bit as well so that's the dress now we move to the sleeves so the sleeves i think i did it about 27 inches long so basically this is it wrong sides facing each other as usual and then i'm just going to seal one side using my hem and net So I'm going to do the rest of camera and then there we have it so now we're going to fold the top as well because we're going to put an elastic band through there so it's basically like the same process we did with the first one so I'm just going to repeat that process only thing is with this with this one I ended up doing the bottom as well because I wanted it to look neat so it's six and then we go around leave um, a little hole take our safety pin and the elastic band and go through it as well just at this time we're going to make the elastic band tighter because it's just going on on the arms and not the body so it's going to be smaller as you can see so I cut it and then I just sew it together push it back in and close the opening so now I'm turning it to the right side and this is your sleeve so this what all I did was just pick one part, raise it up a little, and then I used the safety pin, eh, sorry, I used the needle and thread to just sew it in place, if you can see. So what you have to do is you actually have to create two sleeves. So what we've done, you have to do two of it. And that's how you get your full dress. So it's nothing too fancy, just something to keep it up so it doesn't fall. And then you cut off your thread and this is what it's looking like. So there we have it, that's the sleeve. So I have two sleeves and the dress. So this is the final look. I have the body of the dress and the two sleeves attached thank you so much for watching don't forget to comment share like and subscribe i will see you guys in my next video bye